Hello everybody, this is Abraham at Nashor Computer Services. What we've got here is a uh, Lenovo. It's a um, very inexpensive computer. It has a built-in hard drive. Um, the hard drive is on board, cannot be removed, um, and it goes to the repair screen. As soon as the computer starts, you'll see the Lenovo and you have this prepare and automatic repair. And it just goes in circles, does not boot, does not work. Um, there is no files on here that need to be saved, so we don't care about the information on it. Let's just go ahead and see if we can fix it. Uh, I have done some preliminary work and uh, tried to find what we need to do, so I did some homework. Let's push and hold this to get it to turn off. Okay. I have three different uh, USB flash drives here. And what I found is that sometimes one doesn't work. So I get different manufacturers, different types uh, to see maybe one will work better than another. So I found that this one is not even being recognized by this computer. However, other computers work from it just fine. Uh, this one gets recognized, but something's going on. I can't get into the um, uh, Windows installer on here. And I'm trying to put Windows 10. This one is one of the older ones I have. As you can see, it's from 2019. And this one was the one that worked. Okay, we put the flash drive in. Why is my focus being difficult here? Come on. Okay. Let me move it out a little bit. Okay, that's better. Uh, for Lenovo, we have to push and hold F12 to get into the boot screen. So we push and hold F12 as we push power. Of course. Okay, sorry about that. Um, so when you push and hold F12 and hold F12 and then tap the power, it'll go into the uh, boot menu. And we want to select uh, SanDisk. So this is a SanDisk. We just go into the SanDisk. And we're going to boot from the USB. That will give us the ability to basically do the repairs. Let me use my corded mouse because I'm working on this thing upside down there okay let me bring it closer see if we can get a better view right there mouse is working uh, we're just gonna click next install It's going to start the setup and uh, I haven't done the reinstall on this computer so um, this is the first time I'm doing it. We'll see how it goes. What I like about these uh, flash drives is that they have a light inside so I can see when it's blinking and doing things, this one is... I found this one to be most compatible with everything. Um, not a hundred percent, I still had some computers that were picky. Uh, okay, so we're gonna do... what does that say? Oh, custom. Okay, so the bottom one. And 
and of course it does not see the hard drive which means I have to go out and try and find the driver um, man they just make it difficult not nice okay I have to find the um, hard drive uh, controller driver for this computer which is unusual but in any case that's how you do it on Windows uh, this is Windows 10 I'm also gonna try and see if this one can take Windows 11 maybe drivers isn't are installed in there but for this that's it thank you for watching